Hi everyone, welcome to my channel, Empress Aries 888. It's Friday and pay week. So it's Good Friday after all. It's Good Friday. Yeah, it is. Oh, yeah, it is. All right, we're going to do the energy. And one falls on the ground. Spirit, already stopped. What a trip. All right, I hope you're having a wonderful Friday or whatever time you have tuned in because these are timeless readings, right? Any energy, any sign. And energy doesn't have a gender, but I do say he or she. So please excuse and forgive. Thank you so much for your likes and your subscribes. It means so much to me that you tune in. I'm so appreciative. And like on the way in, it gives me an energetic donation to my channel, as well as helps me to tune in to you, my friends. These are collective, right? Collective readings. So if I said that, I'm repeating it. <laughs> Repetition is the mother of invention. Isn't that what they say? Yeah. All right, so let's get the cards. Let's get spirit. Let's get going, baby, because I don't got much time today. I was playing around, man. Cleaning my trip. All right, it says 100 on the thermostat. Oh, my word, 100. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yikes. This ain't Florida. What's going on? I hope it's cool wherever you are. I hope it's cool. All right, let's get it going. Spirit guides and angels of your whitest light, please give me a clear message for the collective. Please protect my energy as I channel these messages. Please protect my collective. Thank you so much, Spirit, for your guidance, for your healing, and for your hope. We love you. We love you. Every day, not just Friday. Not just Friday when we get paid, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> All right. What is the overall edit? Oh, my goodness. It came right out. Wow. Wow. All right. The seventh chakra archangel uriel but it's in the reverse and strategy came out strategy so what's going on with that i'll take it even though i don't usually take two cards because you know i'm not gonna read you know what i'm saying all right 41 5 and 21 3 is the numbers if you're numeral if you're a numeral like that which i'm not so it's in the reverse let's go with uriel so this copy verse indicates a block to your own intuition and to the potential help and power of the spirit world. Perhaps you fear opening up to this side of your life. Perhaps it's just something that seems foreign or unrealistic. Either way, it's time to awaken to the beauty and power of the realm. See your crown chakra spinning in the beautiful violet or white light and call upon Eero's passion and power to help bring this connection into being. Once you open to the incredible peace and power that spirit can bring, your life will never be the same. Yeah, it's true. It's true. My life was never the same. It was very 3D until I learned about spirit, and then now it's like, a, it's like, like they say, a whole new world. It's a whole new world. It's crazy, but it's, it's true. And some people might not believe they might be not as spiritually awoke, your person, or you. Take you out, resonates, flip the rules. Uh, this could be past, present, or future, you know. Uh, you might not have felt that way in the past, like me, and now all of a sudden you've awoke, and you, you see that the world is not just black and white. There's a lot of gray, baby. Now, strategy is in the upright. So this card shows a pen, a journal, a compass, key. When you receive this card, upright indicates that this is the optimum time for setting up a very specific strategy for achieving your goals. Write about the direction you want to go. Consider any potential change in course and that may be needed. Be aware of the particulars regarding your goals and have some conscious plan in mind. Structure the short-term goals needed to make your long-term goals a reality. This card is telling you to spend some time setting things in order. It's time to take full control. Grab those reins, baby. Add thought to action and set your sights on the road ahead. All right, strategy and the seventh chakra being more awoke and aware of spirit. Because apparently these two things go hand in hand. Okay? Like peanut butter and jelly. Like apples and oranges. They don't go together, but whatever. We'll say they do. We'll say they do. All right, Spirit, give me something here because I got to go. Just a few, just a little reading today. Just fast, fast because I was fooling around and forgot about reading. The reading, how could I? The Spirit. Hi, right, Spirit. Now, because Spirit, I have no time. Do not put these guys on the floor, you trickster. Hang on, these cards are like yikes i'm in such a hurry it's like woo! i'm like nervous wreck goodness gracious calm down i think your person or you is a nervous wreck <laughs> or 
But I think it's also that you really want to do something and you don't know where to begin. That's what it is. That's why strategy is coming in. You're coming up with a plan. Make a new plan, Stan. Don't need to be cold, Roy. Yeah. Hop on the bus, Gus. Don't need to discuss much. Just drop off the key, Lee. Yeah, I think so. Something's going on, man. Somebody's planning, preparing. They don't. They need help, and this is where Uriel's going to come in. This is where strategy and you know writing it down, writing it down. Set your intentions, man. But look at your goals. Plan B's, plan A's, plan Z's. Spirit, give me a card, please. About this. Thank you. Okay. So magician in reverse. Somebody was tricking and trickster illusions, manipulation, lack of self-confidence, and conniving. Page of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Cap, plan of action. There we go. Lay the foundation, baby. Lay that foundation. Your page, please. Your page. Yeah. Yeah. Wanted to be consistent with something. So four of Pentacles, holding on to things and issues, controlling and possessive. So. This could be you or your person. Maybe they were closed off and now they want to come towards you. Now they want a plan. You know, maybe they know they need a plan, but there's been the moon in reverse, uh, blocked intuition, deception, secrets. What's these secrets about spirit? Can you, what's the secret spirit? I want to know more than anything. Let's forget everything I just said and let's find out what the secret is. I want to know. I want to know, Joe, what's the secret? What you holding back from? Spirit, reveal it. Ooh, the secret is the Queen of Pentacles. You've been keeping a secret. You've been keeping a girl? Where? It says a mature, mature grounded female, generous person, sensible great mother, maybe even a witch. Not in the bad way, meaning having abilities. All right. But you were wishy washy and unreliable in this connection. Your person, you take what resonates and leave the rest. If the shoe don't fit, you must acquit. All right, hang on here. Page of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sag. Yeah, somebody was very close minded towards this and pessimistic towards this connection. And they withdrew. They were treated, they were stubborn. Your person's stubborn. Refusing to compromise, giving you very little. And the Queen of Pentacles ain't playing. No, oh, you're not gonna give. Queen of Pentacles is all about that coin, but not about money so much as time, effort, and energy. You ain't gonna give me no effort, no energy? Ooh, yeah. Well, we have to, we're gonna walk. We're gonna see you later. See you later, baby. Nice knowing you. All right, Ten of Wands. So there was a collapse in this connection no letting go yeah definitely two of cups now you want to partner with this person cups is what is it cancer pisces scorpio Ooh, oh my goodness and there goes the cards every single time the four of swords yeah it left the person in anxiety overwhelmed mental overload and in solitude, you know, feeling overwhelmed and not knowing what to do with the loss of the Queen of Pentacles. Justice, karmic justice is happening, honesty. Life lessons are happening for both of you, actually. Then there's the Seven of Pentacles, yeah, in reverse. So poor investment, not finishing what they started, which caused delays and setbacks. And now I have to go get this card. So, excuse, hang on, I gotta go get the card because I can't live like this. Six of Cups. So nostalgia. So they're thinking about you and they can't not think about you anymore. They can't, they can't, they cannot pretend that this connection did not happen, that they did not have this connection with you, that they did not have this feeling for you. They have felt so many repressed emotions for you that they have stuffed down and they can't do it anymore. So now they want to come towards you. They want to plan. They want to make a plan to come towards you because they can't stay away anymore. But they're not as spiritually as awoke as you. So they didn't see in the past the forest for the trees as far as why do they feel this connection with you because you're the soul mate and that's why. You know, and so they can't just forget you and quit you. They can't do it. King of Wands, 
this person's a leader in control, a very proud person, very much in their ego. And that's what's delayed a lot of it. Eight of Cups, they walked away, or you walked away. Because so you, you felt they abandoned you. They didn't give you anything. Four of Pentacles, holding back, possessively controlling, went from the bottom to the top. Six of Pentacles. They, they want to equal reciprocity now. They want to give you what they should have gave you from the beginning but weren't ready to do already. Two of Pentacles, they were juggling people, situations, tied up in other connections, tied up in other connections so they couldn't give it to you. They couldn't give you what you deserved and what you needed at that time. But now they want to, that everything has changed. Why has everything changed, Spirit? Why has everything changed? Yeah. Because their life has been stagnant and unsuccessful and hasn't moved to chariot since. That's why. And they realize why, because they don't have you. There's been disharmony and separation, you know, and a breakdown, breakup, and the love is in reverse. So they could be with whatever, whoever they are with, it's, it's not good and they're not staying. So judgment in reverse, uh, accusations, karmic lessons, bad judgment, all in play here. Maybe they accused you or somebody accused you of something and that's why it broke down and now they're finding out the truth uh, for the lies. The devil, they had addictions and secrecies, but the one secret they kept was you and how they felt about you. And they didn't tell nobody about it. They just kept it to themselves and secretly watch you and obsess about you because they love you. All right, we gotta get going here. So let's go. Spirit, tell me what's gonna happen, Spirit. What is gonna happen in this situation? Knight of Cups in reverse, heartbreaker, deception. They, they had a lot of options. And maybe you didn't feel like they felt anything for you. Unrequited love is on uh, is on the table here. Manipulation. The wheel of fortune, though, is changing the situation. Good luck is coming. Good karma. The sun. The most positive card in the deck. But it also is an illuminator of light. And it can cut through any darkness. So you can't hide from the sun. And so this situation is coming to light what's happened between the two of you. If there was people manipulating this situation, it's coming to light now. They're moving forward. Five of Cups. Looking for forgiveness and healing from you. The Hierophant. They want commitment. They had fat waiting, delays. They felt out of control with their urges to come towards you because they love you. They want you. They need you. They're not going to stay away anymore. They can't do it anymore. You are their queen. And they want to claim you. I want to claim their queen. Five of Pentacles. Yeah, they want positive change. They want to get out of the cold. They feel like, you know, they feel like you, I don't know, like you blocked them or something. Or, you know, they've, they've shattered dreams, Ten of Cups in reverse. But it's all started with this low self esteem and low self worth, you know? But they're letting go of the regret of the past. And they want to choose happiness. They want to choose you, queen. I want to choose you eight of swords they felt trapped you know area uh, gemini libra aquarius in a mental prison queen of wands because you're so confident and sexy they just want you you know you're the you're the queen of pentacles you're successful in their mind you're sexy you're the queen of wands and they might you everything to this person five of wands and they put you in competition and conflict and their ego you know they, they these this is a person who's had many options and they put you as one of them and you're like i ain't an option baby i never was an option i'm either it or not but i'm not gonna ever be on the shelf just saying strength they're looking at inner strength spiritual enlightenment this is happening for this person they are transforming they are growing in their spirituality because they see what you're doing in yours you are being an inspiration to this person and they want, to, they want to match that. They want to match that. But they had emotional immaturity in the past. Ten of Cups in the reverse. Broken family, shattered dreams, domestic disharmony. Where they're at at this point. Spirit, the Emperor's here. So they went from the page, the knight, to the Emperor. In control, a leader. They feared change, though. Death in reverse at the bottom of the deck. But they're not fearing it anymore. They don't care. They want you. It's never going to be about that anymore. They're moving on. They want to communicate. That's uh, five of swords. Yeah. A lot of gossip. Three of cups about this connection. Overindulgences in the past. But now you are their only indulgence. Eight of cups. Yeah, walked away. Again, abandoned you. 
Um, but things are changing in the background. Three of Swords. It only created heartbreak for them. Not just for you, but for them. It, it, it broke their own heart to walk away from you or to treat you that way. And they feel the guilt of that. They miss you. The hermit, they're getting spiritually enlightened. Came from the bottom to the top. Spirit, anything else, please? King of Pentacles. Here we go. Vibrational match. Grounded female. Grounded female. Grounded male. Loyal. They want to be loyal to you. They want to build with you. Yeah. This has been at a crossroads for a long time. But the connection is changing. They're making a decision. And the decision they're going to walk in is to follow their queen. To follow you. Because they fear change. They stayed stuck. But now they want to confess. Seven of Swords. Seven of Cups. They had lots of options and choices. But the only option that they want now is you. That's all I got. That's all I got. Get back to work, peoples. Happy Friday, everybody. Like and subscribe, please. And join my tribe. This is going to happen, baby. It's going to happen for you. Thank you so much for joining me. Join me next time for Empress Series 888. And until then, happy weekend, everybody. Be safe out there, my friends. Be blessed.